Hey everyone, it's Kim Angel Dream Crafts, and I am here with um, my DT box from White Rose Crafts. I'm super, super excited about it. Um, and this will be for end of November and part of December. Um, so you'll be seeing me using these goodies, and uh, I'm so excited about this. Um, I'm sure you can see all these amazing goodies here, but I'll start with the oxides first. I did get some more this month. I got the Wilted Violet. Such a pretty color. I love it. Super duper excited about that. I got Black Soot. Um, and you're going to be seeing me do a tutorial, well, techniques with these um, in the next couple of weeks. I've got some technique projects. Um, coming up for you guys with these products. So this one's Faded Jeans, and look at that. It looks like the perfect denim color. I love it. I got Bundled Sage, and this is such a pretty color. Look how pretty that is. It's like a gray-green. So I'm really, really thrilled to have be getting a good collection of these and this one my favorite ink distress oxide well as well um, peacock feathers love this turquoise color it's so beautiful so those are the oxides I got and I know that the oxides on the site are selling like crazy because I had um, three other ones as well and they're all on back order <laughs> so um, if you're wanting the oxides go get them quickly because they're they're selling out and I know there's been a lot of pre-orders for the full set, so definitely get over there and uh, get the ones you want. The other thing that's new for me this month are these. These are the Nouveau Drops, and I've never worked with these before, so this is going to be a real fun learning thing, and I got a few different colors of these. This one is the glitter one, and I don't know if the camera will pick up the glitter. I hope it will. I hope you can see the glitter in that bottle. It's really super sparkly. I love it. And look at the cool cap. It has a gemstone on top. Isn't that pretty? <laughs> I mean, I know this is not a new product on the market, but it's new to me, so I'm really excited um, to be able to use these. And then this one is um, Antique Rose, which is like a very dusty um, pink, maybe into the rose gold even, so you know I love that. So that's that one. And then this one is uh, Duck Egg Blue. Look at how pretty. I don't know if you can see there, that's better. Let me show you these on the bottom. There you can see those. So really pretty colors. Oh, I love this one. And then this one I tested out yesterday on something and I love it. It dries clear but it adds dimension to the details on your projects. Like if you had a sentiment or something and you use this, it would raise the sentiment up. Kind of like glossy accents, but glossy accents will dry more flat and, and clear. This will give you a bit of a dimension, which I find really cool. So it's definitely different than glossy accents. It has different properties. And I love that it dries clear. So awesome, really happy with that. And then I got some glitter glue. They've got all kinds of glitter glue. Um, this is just like stickles from Dovecraft. And this one is called Crystal. And it's got all the really pretty shimmery tones in it that I love. Um, I was out of my favorite stickles, so I thought, you know, I want to try the Dovecraft brand. And uh, it's super pretty. I love it. And the prices are amazing, too. I also got some more of the glitter ribbon, and I have been using the other glitter ribbon that I got. I got um, last month I got pink and ivory, and this month I got um, silver and turquoise. So really pretty, love it. And these are only a buck a roll. Like so amazing the prices. These I'm super excited about. I'm going to open these. These are called unicorn mini bubbles. And they're like tiny little um, Christmas baubles, like Christmas ornaments. So let me get a couple out here and show you. 
sorry for the, whoops. Okay, I dropped one. Um, so they roll out pretty, <laughs> pretty good, like you can see. But there you can see. Where am I? There we go. They've got tiny little stars inside them. Aren't they cute? And they're glass. So super cute on projects or if you make um, like charm dangles or anything, these would be really great on that. So I love these, really love those. So let me put these back in here before I get another one that rolls off my desk on me. Oh, in there. Okay, so those are cool. And there's all kinds, that's the Dress It Up brand. They've got all kinds of really cool buttons and embellishments um, from Dress It Up in the store. Um, I had the snowflakes and the little tiny uh, cookie cutters last month. So this month I got those. So I love these really cool embellishments. Um, and then I got this, which is by Artemo, and it is 51 pieces of pearls and then 24 white flowers. So you can make your own flowers, you can color them with the oxides, or paint them, or spray them, or anything. So I'm going to be using some of those this month, I, I thought they were cool. And I got a die this month, which is, what is this by Couture Creations. It is a layered snowflake die, so I'm excited about that as well, because I, I do not have a snowflake die. This is from the Be Merry collection. And there's the die on the back. So really excited to use that. And, uh, you can use them separately or layer them up. So I think that'll be really, really pretty and fun for Christmas projects. And then I hit the Tim Holtz clearance section again on the store and I got two more stamp sets for five dollars. And you know Stampers Anonymous stamps are not cheap. They're very expensive but White Rose Crafts has these for five dollars. So such a bargain. This one, I don't know if it has a name, does it? I don't know. But anyway, this one is like the Europe stamp set, I guess. It's got the Union Jack, British flag, it's got the, um, the soldier there that guards Buckingham Palace, and the Eiffel Tower, a fleur de lis, some Paris, New York, London, um, postcard, airmail. Like, I just love it. Super cute. So I'm definitely going to be using this this month. I love that. And then the other one I got is um, all French, and it says artist here, which I like that stamp a lot. So that's why I got this one. And I love the diamond shape here and the big, um, the big stamp here with the postmark on it. And then there's a little stamp and a little flourish. And of course, the Eiffel Tower. You can never have too many Eiffel Tower stamps. <laughs> and I also got a couple of stencils. This one is by Couture Creations as well, I believe. Yes, it is. And they've got several in the store. I know they've got that one and this one and this one as well. I'm not sure about the others, but I know that they have these three as well as this one. And this is stars. Now, for me, I can use this all year round because they're stars, so that's why I loved it, but it will be good for the holiday season, and I'm going to be using that on a project um, next week. You'll see me using that. I'm already starting to work on it. I also got this one, which is by Clear Scraps, and they're little snowflakes. So lots of fun there. Excited about those. And then I, for the paper this month, I got this by Altair Art, and they're all butterflies that I can cut out. So I'm going to be using these um, on my project for next week as well. So you're going to see me using those, and I'm going to glitter them and make them all pretty, and I'm very excited to use these. And that's the back, already done for you. Um, and they have quite a few... Um, ephemera pieces like this that you can get and just cut out your fussy cut out your own pieces so I thought that was really cool and you know I love butterflies and then this I really thought was awesome they have a lot of these these are um, 3d die cut decoupage um, papers by craft creations and this is a UK brand 
and this one's called Snow Princess, and I just fell in love with her. Isn't she amazing? But what you do is you take this piece and then you cut, you, well they just punch out actually, you don't even have to cut them. Um, you take out the other pieces, like there's another head, her cape, another full body, um, another piece with the tree and everything, and you layer them up on top of each other, so you get a really cool um, 3D effect. Uh, so I'm excited about that. And it also comes with these little pieces that you can make embellishments out of. Like, you know, the embellishments I made with the rhinestones around them? Wouldn't those, these be cute? And that. And there's a tag and an inchy and a couple of other little pieces here. So I can make embellishments out of those. So I'm really excited. Isn't she pretty? I love this image. It's so pretty. So I'm going to be using that, and then for papers, I got these two. This, I know my shabby chic friends are going to love. This is vintage postcards, but look, this one's in black and white, and any way you turn it, it looks beautiful. It's got script on it, it's got beautiful vintage women images on it. I love it. I absolutely love this paper. And this is by Craft Creations as well. And I'll just hold that up here so you can see. It's called Vintage Postcards. Whoops. Black and white. So that's what it is in the store by Craft Creations. So I got it in the black and white. And I also got it in the sepia. So, yeah. I know my shabby chic friends are going to love this. Wouldn't this be beautiful on the top of a box? Or you could make an envelope out of this and shabby chic it up and um, yeah, it would just be beautiful and then put like a, a vintage letter inside the envelope. It would be so pretty. So lots of great things. Love the postcard here with the stamps. So super pretty paper. And I did also get two sheets of Christmas paper, but I would already started the project with them before I was like, oh no. So. Um, I'm sure you're going to guess what it is, but uh, these are Lemon Craft, which you can't really see at the moment because I've just at the top of it, but I made it into a box. These are two pieces of Lemon Craft Christmas paper. This is the B side, one red and one green, and then this is the A side with the script on it. And then the A side of this one has music paper on it. So I'd already used those, but I wanted to show those um, because they have a huge selection of lemon craft paper. So I'm, uh, you're going to guess what my project is, I'm assuming. So. <laughs> anyway, um, that is it for right now. I just wanted to share with you my next ET. Um, box from White Rose Crafts. As you can see, I got lots of really beautiful, amazing things. I'm super excited to play with all of these this month. I love everything, um, and I'm just having such a great time on the team. Such a wonderful, warm and welcoming uh, group of ladies, and um, fantastic products. I just love their products. So I'm excited to try all these new and different things I haven't done before, like the Nouveau Drops. So. Um, yeah, go and check them out, and um, if you're looking for any of these and you have issues, you can certainly mes message me and I can uh, help you if you need help, any help on the site. The site is very easy to maneuver, but if you, know, if you have any questions or anything, I'm happy to answer them. So that's it for right now, guys. I will talk to you soon. Take care, everybody. Bye.